So in the series of learning C programming, we are discussing file handling in C. We have discussed all the file opening modes like read, write, append, R plus, W plus, C plus mode. Now we are left with some special function in C, uh, special function in file handling that is FC, rewind, FTEL. So in this video, we will talk about FC function. So these function play a very important role in random access of a file, right? So in this video, we will uh, see about uh, FC function. What is this function? Why we use this function? How to use this function in your program? At everything, every single detail about this function we will see in this video with the help of a program. I will show you practical also, right? Now before that, just want to ask one thing. How many of you are appearing for GATE 2022 exam? I am sure it is most of you guys. So that is why I am here with some interesting and very important news for you guys. Geeks for Geeks has introduced a GATE CS All India MOOC 3 which is a simulation of the actual examination format. As we always say, practice is the key. So appearing for this MOOC will definitely boost up your confidence and definitely it will help you in improving your weak points. This test consists of complete syllabus and the question pattern of GATE 2022. It is going to have MCQs, MSQs and net numerical type of questions. It will help you to understand your strong points and your weakness so that you know accordingly you can prepare for your gate exam and you will get familiar with the examination pattern and mode and most importantly you can take this mock test free of cost it would be on 29th of january and it would be live for 24 hours for more information and instruction you can go to the link which i'll put in the description box of this video so to take this examination what you have to do you just have to register the registration link i'll put in the description box of this video you can go and check out now let us see what is fseq function see suppose we have a file abc.txt and in this file i have suppose this i have in my file so now fseq function is going to move why we use this function to move the cursor the file pointer to a specific position right now what does that mean suppose i want to read from this file i want to read only this khatri is awesome not jenny but when you open this file in read mode, the cursor would be in the beginning. But I, I don't want to read this Jenny. I want to read from here. So first of all, you are supposed to move the cursor from here to here. And then till end of the file, you can read. You can write down the logic. You can write down the while loop. So for moving this cursor from here to here, which function we will use? Fseq. Right? Means we are moving the cursor to a specific position. Right? like rewind function is used to move the cursor from end to beginning or maybe the cursor is from uh, cursor is here so if you use rewind function that would be moved from here to here from any position to beginning rewind is used for that that also we'll discuss with the help of a program but fc is to move the cursor to a specific position right now suppose cursor is here and now i move to uh, i want to move this cursor from here to here from here to here so now cursor is not in the beginning, cursor is to a specific position. So from here also you can move the cursor to this position. Or maybe from the end also you can, cursor is here and you want to move the cursor from here to here. So that also you can do, right? Everything we will discuss. With the help of FC you can do all these things, right? And you can update also, suppose rather than Jenny Khatri is awesome faculty, rather than Khatri here I want to write like Jenny uh, Lamba. That also you can do, right? You can update this file with the help of fseq function, right? Just you, you are supposed to take care of the opening mode, in which mode you are opening this file, right? Everything you can do. So, main thing is to move the cursor to a specific position, we use fseq function, right? Now, what is the syntax of writing this function? Just write down fc. Three argument it will take. First would be file pointer, right? Next would be offset. And next would be position or origin, anything you can say, three uh, arguments are there. So obviously file pointer, the data type is file, for offset, the data type is long int and for position, the data type is int and the data type of this function, the return type is int. It will return 0 if successful successfully it has updated the file pointer otherwise it will return a non zero value right now file pointer obviously which file pointer is pointing to this file that you will write here offset means how many bytes you want to move 
that that cursor how many bytes you want to move right from a particular position suppose from here i want to move to khatri so how many 1 2 3 4 5 6 space is also so 6 would be offset that is what offset how many bytes you want to move forward or backward if you want to move forward then positive value you will write if you want to move backward then you will write a negative value right position means from which position you want to add the off offset means you want to move the cursor from the beginning or from a particular position or from end from which position you want to move you want to skip the content right so this position is going to have three values like seek underscore set these are predefined function right this is already defined in stdio.h you are supposed to include this file seek set it means the position is beginning of the file seek underscore cur means current position of the file pointer current position of file pointer from the current position of file pointer i want to move maybe backward or forward this means from the beginning i want to move right from the beginning obviously we'll move forward and if you want to move from the end seek end underscore end means end of the file from the end of the file position is end of the file and from end of the file i want to move from here like to backward you can move right so how you will use these three you no know, position here and how you will write how to use this fc function in your program i'll show you this with the help of a program right so just obviously we are supposed to declare a file pointer first i am declaring this with null and i am going to open this f open and uh, the name of the file is abc.txt and i am opening this in read mode simple because my main motto is to you know help you to understand what is fseek function you can try out this fseek function with any mode r w a r plus w plus a plus but you know in every mode it is going to show some different result so that you need to try yourself right once you get what is fc function you can do this these variations you can do you no know, these kind of uh, you know things with this fc function you can try out different different with different different modes but i'm opening right now in this read mode only read mode right so just you you are supposed to check first if this fp is equal to is equal to null means simply you can print cannot open file and exit that's it otherwise if you are opening this in read mode then the cursor would be from here in the beginning right now index would be this one 0 then 1 then 2 then 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 like this space is also having a index right now what you will do if suppose from khatri from here i want to read khatri is awesome i don't want to read jenny only khatri is awesome so first i'll move this cursor from here to here to sixth position right so what you will write f c file pointer is fp i am taking offset what you will write 6 how many 1 2 3 4 5 6 6, six byte you want to skip and here you want to move so offset would be 6 this we are going to add see i'll show you and the position is c underscore from starting c underscore set this is for starting right means in this position i want to add this one so current position is this one that is 0 0 plus i want to add 6 is equal to 6 so now cursor would be at this position at sixth index here and at sixth index i have k so suppose a single character if i want to read here using f get c and the fp and simply i am going to print print f percentage c ch before using this ch i i yes, i am supposed to declare this so what it will print k because now using fc we have moved the cursor to this position and now k would be printed now i hope you got this right if you want to modify this obviously if you want to write something to this position then you you are supposed to open this in maybe w mode or r plus mode or w plus mode right that also you are supposed to try but that thing will give different different results right now see 
after using f get c now it is printing k and now the cursor is moved to here now file pointer is here at seventh index like at, at h so now if suppose you want to move this three position backward i want to print y one character y right so how you can move simply you can write down f seek f p and now backward means minus you will write minus 3 and here you will write f seek underscore c u r from the current position i want to move not from beginning now from the current position so for that we have seek dot c u r and now if you will print f get c c h is equal to and if you in print f simply you will write percentage c c h what it will print after using f get c the cursor moved to here now minus 3 minus 3 means now you can say you can write down like this at 7th index we have h minus 3 this offset you are supposed to add in this position minus 3 means minus 3 plus if you will do plus minus 3 obviously that would be minus 3 7 minus 3 is equal to 4 now at 4th position we have y so it would print y I hope now you got this after printing this y now obviously cursor would be moved to the next position here at the space now cursor is here at fifth index right now from the end suppose i want to print like this o i want to print from the end from here also you can move from the current position also from the beginning also you can move now but i want to know write down the third variant that is f seek f p minus 3 and seek underscore end and suppose here you write if you write this thing ch is equal to f get c and you will print character then minus 3 means from here minus 3 1 2 3 minus 3 so o would be printed so it will print o if you will do is use here f get c ch and you will print that ch then it will print o right so if you want to move the cursor to a specific position you can use f seek these are the three variant you can use using set using cur using end this is a simple example of just i'm opening the file in read mode right now after moving this cursor here you can update this also right suppose if you are opening this file in r plus mode that is also for reading and writing so you can do that thing but if you write w plus mode means the previous content would be erased so here it would create some problem right obviously if you are moving this cursor from to, to the sixth offset and you are printing nothing would be printed because once you open this in w plus mode the previous content would be erased so what it will print nothing but in r plus mode it can print because previous content would be as it is right so this you need to take care and obviously you are familiar with these modes so according to that you can modify your program right if you want me to upload any video on a specific mode like you suppose to use fc function in r plus mode or w plus mode or a plus mode then you can tell me in comment box i'll make a complete video and i'll show you that with the help of a program now let me show you practical of this program so let's create a new file fc.c right and i'm just going to copy this this content because this would be same right so it will save our time right now abc.txt I'm, I'm opening this in read mode only right and in abc.txt suppose i have jenny khatri is or some faculty right now in our file f dot c now what we will see first of all i am going to move the cursor right f c f p and offset i am taking 6 only and position i am taking what f c underscore set means from the starting from the beginning i want to move so if you want to read the complete file from the sixth 
offset to complete then you can just write down a while loop that I hope you can do. But let us suppose I am just reading a single character just to you know clear the function of this F seek. I am reading a single character right the position. So, sorry this you will write and I am just printing this. And before using this obviously ch we have declared and then f close. fp that is it right. So, what it will print see let me just run this and show you the output. See it is printing k right it is printing k 6 offset 6 position from beginning it is going to 6 character 6 byte is it is going to skip and after that it will print that is k it is going to print right. Now, suppose uh, if after that I am writing this same I am going to copy right and now I am writing minus 3 minus 3 3 step backward 3 byte backward I want to move the cursor from the current position right. So, seek underscore c u r current right and now just print the character what it will print it will print k as well as y see it is printing k y. Let me just uh, know format this with a slash in and now let me run this. See first is k then it is printing y. First is k then 3 step backward and it will print y. Why it is printing y? Because after f get c function the cursor is at which alphabet h. I have described this in the video and now 3 position backward means it is printing y. Right. Now, let me just use the third variant also that minus 3 from end from E and D from end position right. So, now what it will print? First it is printing it will print K then Y then L see L it is printing right. Let me just show you the file from the end minus 3 means 1 2 3 that is L it is printing. So, now I hope the basic function of this F seek is clear to you with this read mode right. If you are going to add something right suppose I am opening this file in let me show R plus mode it is worth for reading and writing right and it is not going to erase the previous content. So, that would be as it is. So, now suppose I am writing at 6th position after moving this Let me just comment everything out and after moving to 6th position f put s I am I know at 6th position I want to update that thing whatever is, is written with high. So, comma f p semicolon control s right that is it. So, it is not going to print anything on the screen it will print the, that file also in that file right now I have Jenny Khatri is also faculty. Now, after running this program what would be the content of this file let me just show you. See on the screen it is not going to print anything because I am not reading anything from the file. So, see it is printing Jenny then H i k h has been replaced by the character H i then everything would be same. So, if you want to update a specific that file from a specific position just move the cursor to that position just open the file in R plus mode and then move the position to the specific position from where you know at which you want to update the content and then you can write down. So, now hi would be written at which of offset 6th after 6 to uh, character it will add h i hi. I hope now you got this. This is how you can update the file also. But if you will open this file in W plus mode, then the previous content would be erased, then how it is going to move the cursor, right. So, that you can do yourself, right. That is assignment for you guys. If you open the file in W plus mode or W mode, if you open the file in A mode, append mode or A plus mode, then what it will do? That is your assignment, you have to practice that thing. So, I hope now this is clear to you.
so i hope the main motive of this f seek function is clear to you guys and don't forget to register for the gate all india mock test the link would be in the description box so now i'll see you in the next video till then bye bye take care